welcome back to the 2Gen Beauty and Lifestyle channel. I am still calling it the 2Gen Beauty and Lifestyle channel because I am in the process of trying to come up with a new name. So if you have any ideas, please comment below and let me know what you think. I'm really looking for something that incorporates maybe my name, Lucy, and the concept of cruelty-free together. So just let me know what you think. But for now, we're still going to be 2Gen Beauty. Um, so this video that I wanted to share with you guys is about a new cosmetics brand that I learned about and their name is Prestige Cosmetics and they did send me a few goodies to try out and I just wanted to give you guys my opinion on how I felt about the products and just what the quality is. I did look up their pricing so I could give you a good idea on that as well and talk a little bit about you know what I put together on my face today because everything that they sent me I did use today as well as some of my own products just to you know fill in so just to give you an idea uh, this brand you can actually find them on www.prestigecosmetics.com and this is a new line that they're carrying called Total Intensity so very cool I will post some pics on social media with the hashtag Total Intensity. So go ahead and search for the hashtag and see what you find and let me know what you think as well. So I'm going to dive right into what they sent me and it's in this little black bag. I did look up the bag on their website and it's not there so I'm thinking this is maybe just like a promotional item. So I cannot give you like a retail price on that. So just to kind of get right in here. I'm going to start with probably application wise. So I did go um, ahead and start with a full face. I put on my Juice Beauty um, CC cream and powder and concealer just to kind of put a face together. It's not, I'm not re even really going anywhere today. I did this face again. I actually did this face yesterday because I went to um, an event and I just didn't have time to, to tape the video. So redid it today for you guys and um, got dressed because I was in my pajamas. So <laughs> uh, let's dive right in. So I did go ahead and do a full face. And to be honest, I did not even put um, a, like a shadow base. I completely forgot. So just to kind of give you a heads up, like this eyeshadow is with no base whatsoever. So they sent me this little trio, Total Intensity. These are more like nudie colors and it is in the shade Mirage. If I can give you guys a good idea. I don't even know if you really get like a full picture of what the colors look like. Uh, but if you go on their website, it is under total intensity and you'll see eyeshadow trios. And it is described as having uh, a duochrome color and highly pig they are extremely highly pigmented. So I'm just going to uh, explain what I did. I went in with like this nude uh, shimmery base kind of all over my lid. I went in with the darker color in the crease and then I went in with this lighter color um, in the brow bone and in the inner circle. And I'm going to swatch these on my hand for you right now so you can kind of see what they look like. And I mean, they're really high, highly pigmented. This dark one, I'm so glad that I actually tested it on my hand before I applied it because it is very pigmented. All right. So here you have that darker color. It, I thought it was going to be more of like a brown, but it's actually kind of like a, like a mix between a brown and a black, at least in my opinion. Then we've got the center color, which is like that... Uh, color I used all over my lid. It's kind of like a taupey nude color. And then we've got the shimmery lighter color. Um, they're all very, very pretty. They all have shimmer in them. I feel like this darker color has some like brown shimmer in it. Uh, this center color has some duochrome in it. It's almost like a taupey. And then it also has kind of like maybe a rose gold kind of um, thing to it and then this vanilla um, color. So I used all three of those on my lids today. Give you guys a good idea. 
tried to blend it as good as possible. I was going for kind of like a pinup y look because I, when I got the color, I was like, oh, those are kind of like pinup colors because they used to do like a nude eye. Um, so the next thing I have is, let's see, the eyeliner. And the eyeliner, oh, this retails for $12.50 on their website. So I will say everything is really reasonably priced and affordable. Um, and like I said, I the colors themselves were highly pigmented. They did not have any fallout, very buttery, um, very nice texture. So I was very, very impressed with the eyeshadow. Um, the eyeliner retails for $5.95. And it is a pencil eyeliner, just so you could see. And it is in the color Deepest Black. Um, so I am not a huge fan of pencil eyeliners. And I did not express this. They asked me, hey, what would you like for us to send you? We'd love for you to try the products. And I should have said, please don't send me a pencil liner. But I didn't. Um, regardless, like it is a very creamy like a very creamy pencil liner. You can see it just glides right on. Um, but I like to do like a wing look. So I don't know about you guys, but I used to do this back in high school. And I'm not gonna say what my age is. Well, I don't care, I'm 38 years old, it doesn't matter. Um, I used to do this in high school with my pencil liners. Lighter. And eyeliner brush. Actually, I used this brush, which is like my all-time favorite eyeliner brush of all time. I don't know if you can see it. It is from Tarte Cosmetics, and I love it because it has this bend, which makes all the difference in the world. So, you light the tip a little bit, you blow it out if it catches on fire. If not, you just kind of get it, and it'll get into like a gel consistency, and then you can dip your brush in there and go to town. And that is exactly what I did. So I think they came out really well. I love gel liner and I love liquid liner. Um, I tend to stay away from pencil liners. I don't put eyeliner under my eyes. I don't tight line my eyes. Um, so aside from that, I thought this was a really good product. Like I said, it was super creamy and you know it did the job. So I just needed to kick it old school with the lighter and the brush and I did it. So this was very good. And they also sent me the little sharpener for it. And I love these sharpeners because it has the two holes. So you have for those big crayons and you have for the small crayons as well. And this sharpener retails on their website for $3.50. And I love that it has like the little plastic to catch like all of your stuff in there. So you can see I actually sharpened it today. So there's some gunk in there. The next thing that I used was their mascara in the color uh, black, blackest black as well, and it is called My Blackest Lashes Intense Black Volume Mascara. And the mascara retails for $8.50 on their website. And I really like the formula. A, there's two things I really, really like about this mascara. First is the brush, because it's like a thick, full brush. And I like that because I feel like it's really getting into all my lashes and just coating them really well. And the formula itself is, it almost has like a gel-like consistency. It's not um, drying. It's not clumpy. Um, it just, it's so smooth. It's like just, that's what it reminds me of, like a gel-like consistency, if I could explain it. Ooh, and it's made in Italy. So this was a very cool product as well. I really, really like the mascara. The last thing that I used, or not the last thing I used, I'm sorry. I'll talk about this one separately because I used it a little bit. And it's not really a makeup item, but it is like amazing. Okay, so this is the Total Intensity uh, Total Wear Lip Crayon in You Read My Mind. Very smooth. Um, it's not like a matte consistency, but it's not like ultra, ultra glossy either. And I would say it has pretty good staying power. A um, couple of hours. It's not, like I said, it's not a matte consistency. It's like a lipstick. So 
you just have to kind of, you know, reapply every so often. It's a very pretty red. I'll swatch that right there for you guys. You can see it. It's a very, very pretty red color. And this lip crayon uh, retails for $9.50 on their website. So this last little item right here. I wish they had this when I was growing up. It is the makeup eraser pen. Without this, I have been using Q-tips and like makeup remover because we all know how hard it is to get this damn little wing to look right. This precisely fixes your makeup flaws. Prestige Cosmetics, you guys are just geniuses. And it's kind of like a foamy tip, but you can get detailed, you can go, you know, a lot just to, uh, I've got some makeup on. So I'm going to run that through the mascara. Look at that. Look at that. Just fixes it. Look at that. Just fixes it. So this is a great tool. Especially like if you're still kind of trying to get the hang of the winged liner, which I've been doing my entire life, still trying to get the hang of the winged liner. Um, so this was a very cool item. And this retails on their website for $9. And I think that this alone is just a great investment. So it is the Makeup Eraser Pen. Wonderful. So that is really everything that I received from Prestige Cosmetics. I do highly recommend them. They, um, I mean, I was impressed with all of the products, uh, except for just me not personally liking like a pencil liner. I think the pencil liner is really, really creamy. It does a really good job, and I suited it to what I need. And what um, I'm going to do for you guys is I'm going to put a link to their website in the, in the description box below. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the look. It's kind of simple, like nothing really dramatic. I went with like, oh, you can see my nails as well, red and red. So I will put some information down in the description regarding the brand and where you can find them and what products I received. And I hope you check them out and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and share it to all of your, your beauty friends across the world. Have a great afternoon. Bye-bye.